Wouldn't it be nice if you could digitize your agreement workflows alongside your existing applications and services within the Microsoft stack? Today, we have a special guest, Muhammad Ali from DocuSign, who's going to tell us all about that. Stay tuned. Hi everyone, welcome back to the Low Code Revolution show. Today I have a special guest from DocuSign, Muhammad Ali, who's going to take us through DocuSign and how it can work alongside your existing applications and services within the Microsoft stack. Muhammad, I'm going to hand it over to you so you can introduce yourself to the viewers today. Thank you, Eliza. Good day, everyone, and welcome. Thanks for joining today's session. My name is Mo, Muhammad Ali. Um, I'm a Principal Solutions Architect at DocuSign. Really excited today to talk to you about how customers can really transform their agreement workflows using DocuSign and Microsoft together. So let's let's head over to our um, presentation and, and, and we can go from there. All right. So quick safe hub before we get started. This is just a reminder to base all purchasing decisions on current offerings and not on future statements that may be made today. Okay, that's out of the way. Let's get started. Um, I do want to start looking at really the bigger picture. So what, when we think about DocuSign and Microsoft, what does that really mean? Um, we're looking at integration and automation and it, really that helps you get work done faster but it also helps you make better business decisions. So specifically on agreements, it can help you unlock the data in your agreements to help you be more informed and better, better make better business decisions on, on you know, key information that's available. Reduce the errors that, that are available as well. So if you think about you know, manually keying in information, it, you, you may add an extra zero to, to an order form and, it's, and essentially you've you've changed uh, you know, a, a lot of information there. Um, and there's fewer documents lost in the black hole of someone's desktop, and there's no more invoices that, that fall through the cracks anymore. Um, so essentially we're helping you boost your company performance. So a higher uh, productivity company means higher profits, means faster growth. And for employees, we're removing all the manual drudgery of, of you know, uh, repetitive tasks, um, and, and so you can focus more on the strategic and, and creative parts of your work. So, so basically, employees are more engaged. And Gallup tells us that you know um, employees that are more engaged have a lower turnover rate, and, and they're happier in their jobs. So it's a it's a win win. A little bit about agreements. It is what DocuSign's been heavily focused on for the last twenty plus years. Um, but what are agreements? So they're the blueprint of an organization. They live throughout every part of your company. Um, if you think about when you join a company as an employee, there's an employment contract. If you're selling something, there's a sales order, a sales agreement. Um, if you're in procurement, there might be a vendor agreement. Um, there might be an overarching master service agreement. Um, if you're providing services, you know, an SOW. And, and a host of other examples there. So essentially they underpin your organization. And DocuSign will help you um, create these agreements, commit to, and manage them end to end. Um, and so that's really where that partnership with DocuSign, uh, with uh, Microsoft um, is, is crucial. And so we have determined that, that these agreements are crucial and was just as crucial as the ability to integrate those agreements into the apps you're working in every day today. And that's why we've invested so heavily building a robust integrations ecosystem. With 400 plus integrations, our customers can connect DocuSign to the systems they use on a daily basis, which helps eliminate the manual cumbersome you know, part of switching between apps so instead of making uh, work seamless and easy. And as one of DocuSign's strategic partners, the same holds true for Microsoft applications. So from the basics like Word and Outlook to the more recent integrations like Copilot for sales, Copilot for N365, uh, which I'll show you a bit later, we're very excited about. Um, so we integrate with, with into your systems um, that you use every day, which is essentially opening the door for these easy integrations. 
And together, DocuSign and Microsoft connect and automate agreement processes end-to-end to help you streamline that workflow and keep users in their flow of work. So if you visualize a general agreement process, each step along the way, um, our Microsoft integration can help you integrate and automate this work from end-to-end. So when we look at DocuSign's suite of integrations um, that we are looking at, at the on the screen right now, your users can execute agreement tasks in their normal flow of work without toggling between applications. Your admins can scale processes by routing data and documents between systems. And DocuSign is really the only solution that can integrate across the entire agreement journey and meet the diverse needs of use cases across an organization. And if we look at this process from end to end, as an example, um, the Power Platform, Power Automate, um, it touches several of these areas, allowing you to automate workflows between your favorite apps to synchronize agreements, get notifications, collect data, and more. And like I mentioned earlier, um, the integrations can certainly d- do this for you know, your, your standard kind of um, sales or procurement contracts, but DocuSign and Microsoft can help any department get work done faster. Um, if, if you look in the screen today, this is some of the really common uh, use cases that are based on millions of, of touch points between the DocuSign and Microsoft integration. Um, so if you look at, for instance, client onboarding, uh, it could be an RFP process. We can help with these end-to-end processes as well. And I'd like to actually delve into one of these today. That that uh, customer vendor partner onboarding journey um, is a, is a very important one for us. Um, so if we look at that process, customers need a, a custom solution uh, for intake and data capture, which feeds into these agreements. So and, and then it propagates down to the systems and departments driving these downstream workflows. Um, Taking a look at this from a different angle, so the same process but visualized from a more system perspective, the value we can bring is working closely with our customers to build solutions, leveraging DocuSign, Microsoft and other systems to cater for their specific requirements. So the DocuSign platform delivers tools from out-of-the-box integrations that you can see here, to low-code, no-code workflow building blocks, especially with Power Automate, um, to more robust APIs for for very custom implementations. And what I'm excited about to show you right now is um, an example of how Power Automate and DocuSign work really well together. So this this example will run through a candidate offer letter, generating a candidate offer letter, from SharePoint, sending it out, getting it signed, and then you know uh, returning that that signed document back into the Microsoft ecosystem. So let, let, let me show you that now. Um, it is something that's a, a, a very common use case for us, and it's uh, very popular. With DocuSign for Microsoft Power Automate, you can incorporate DocuSign capabilities into your workflows and automation processes. You can connect hundreds of applications, including Microsoft and partner applications such as DocuSign, to build end-to-end workflows in an easy-to-use interface. The DocuSign connector includes a DocuSign trigger and various DocuSign actions that you can add to your Power Automate flows. To begin, Click Create. You can create a brand new flow or leverage one of the available templates. Type DocuSign in the search bar and choose a template. In this example, we choose a template that automatically generates an envelope via SharePoint or Word and archives the signed documents. The flow will trigger when a new item is added to a SharePoint list. A document will be generated using data from the list. The data is dynamically inserted and automatically blends with the document content before it is added to a DocuSign envelope and sent for signature. When the envelope has been signed, it will be saved in a dedicated SharePoint folder. Click Continue to configure your flow. 
In this example, we enter the SharePoint site address and list name for the event trigger and first action. Next, we select the eSignature account and template that will be used to send the envelope. An eSignature template has already been created with the recipient placeholder information and base document. Review the dynamic data fields that will be used for the recipients and edit them if needed. Then choose the envelope status. Select Sent to send the envelope immediately, or select Created to save the envelope as a draft. In this case, we select Created so that we can make additional edits to the envelope before it is sent for signature. Click the Advanced Options menu to customize the email subject and message. We then use the next two actions to obtain the document and document generation form fields information. Document generation fields are placeholder fields which have been added to the template document. They will be replaced with dynamic values when the document is generated. The next action is used to map the document generation placeholder fields with dynamic values. In this case, we are using dynamic values from the SharePoint list. You can edit those if needed. The following three actions will be used to place a signature and a date signed field for the signer. First, we update the action to obtain the recipient information that will be used to automatically place the fields next to a specific string of text. The anchor text strings have already been added on the template document to specify where the fields should be placed. Customize the field placement and properties or add additional fields if needed. Then we use the Send Envelope action to send the draft envelope for signature. Finally, we will monitor the envelope status with DocuSign Connect so that once the envelope is completed, the envelope documents are automatically saved in SharePoint. We select the eSignature account and then choose the SharePoint site and folder where the documents should be saved. Use the flow checker to identify any potential errors or warnings. Click Save when you're done and click Test to make sure your flow runs as expected. For any questions, contact your DocuSign account team or DocuSign support. Beautiful. That was, um, I mean, Power Automate is one of my passions and um, it just, I just love, love using it. I, I just I just find it so useful and, and um, popular with a lot of our customers. Um, so, yeah, I, I just, I mean, I, I can talk about it all day, basically. Me too. But, uh, I right. love Power Automate. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, so, so, and that's one of the areas that we're very excited about, um, about how we're helping customers revolutionize their agreement workflows. Um, most recently, we've also partnered with Microsoft to develop integrations to Copilot, another area I'm very excited about. Um, and we're proud to be one of the first partners to build integrations to Copilot for sales and Copilot for M365 to unlock productivity across the organization by delivering relevant agreement information to users directly where they're working. So. Let me show you this in, in the next demonstration because it is something we're also very excited about um, and I'll let you decide. The DocuSign integration for Copilot for Sales is a new AI assistant tool from Microsoft designed to maximize seller productivity personalize customer interactions, and keep sellers in their flow of work. DocuSign for Copilot for Sales delivers critical, relevant agreement information without having to switch between Outlook and your customer relationship management, also known as a CRM, platform. You can now see all DocuSign agreements related to Dynamics or Salesforce CRM accounts and opportunities inside Copilot for Sales, including updates on the latest agreement status and the ability to quickly view contracts in DocuSign with the click of a button. Let's see how it works. 
Tony is a salesperson for Tally International. Preston Stanfield is a contact at Consolidated Co., who is looking to purchase some widgets from Tally. Tony fields the email from Preston and opens Copilot for sales. He quickly sees that Preston is associated with the Consolidated account. Before scheduling a call with Preston, Tony needs to make sure Consolidated has signed an NDA with Tally. In Copilot for Sales, Tony pulls up the Tally account information. Under Account Insights, he can see the DocuSign agreement information from the CRM. He confirms that Tally has a recently signed NDA. To verify, Tony clicks on the More Info card and views the agreement in DocuSign. He then proceeds with scheduling the call. After the call with Preston, Tony is ready to send over the sales agreement. He opens the opportunity in Dynamics and using the integration with DocuSign eSignature, prepares and sends the envelope for Preston to sign. After Preston signs and completes the agreement, Tony gets an email notification. When he checks Copilot for sales, he can see the updated agreement information from the CRM without switching applications. With DocuSign for Copilot for sales, you and your teams can be more effective in customer engagements and maximize productivity by accessing relevant account and agreement information without having to switch back and forth between applications. That was really cool, Mo. Thanks for, for showing us that. And congratulations, DocuSign, on being one of the first partners to extend the capabilities of Copilot for Sales. Thank you so much. It's yeah something we're very proud of, so thank you for that. Um, yeah, I mean, just the, the, the imagine the productivity gains um, from not having to switch between all different apps and having all that information at your fingertips. I mean, it just really aligns really well with, I think, what, what Copilot's are looking to achieve as well. So, yeah, it's great. That's all I had for today. But um, thank you very much for inviting me to your um, show. Um, I've, I've really appreciated the time we've had here. Thank you. Yeah, thanks. Thanks, Mo. I really liked how you showed us how DocuSign was platform agnostic across the Microsoft stack. Just shows the incredible reach it has um, in terms of digitizing the agreement workflow. So it was really cool to see. And uh, yeah, thank you everyone for joining us today. And we'll see you next time in the next episode of the Low Code Revolution Show. Bye.